Afternoon guys, I'm 3HHY here. Just walking across um, Earlham Locks, um, just outside Trafford in Greater Manchester. Um, I'm trying to do a, a range test of the um, Kydera DPMR 550S, but it's, uh, it's not going so well. I think the metal shrouding around this bridge isn't helping. Um, Royden's a couple of miles to my left up the river, up the canal, um, with his radio. And uh, I'm, uh, I'm down this end, so. As I say, it's not going too well for now, but we'll, uh, we'll see how we go. I'll get back to you in a bit. M0 LEX Mobile, M3HHY Mobile Return. Yeah, loud and clear, uh, loud and clear, Royden from M3HHY. Back to you. Yeah, it's just a little bit of packing. So, what I'm going to do is then, for the rest of the journey back to the car, uh, I'm going to stick with the uh, Kydera on the non stack on the diamond antenna. And uh, we'll give it a try from there, over. Yeah, M3 HHY uh, mobile returning. Yeah, well, you, you're sounding okay. Um, the audio is a l not as clear, but it's uh, it's there. It's uh, readable, fully readable. Uh, I'm just back in the car now. Um, but yeah, uh, I wonder how you're receiving me. M3 HHY mobile. Yeah, I'm getting you fine. Are you uh, on the external one turning the car, or are you still on the uh, you still on the on the diamond, or are you like you know, the other antenna? Yeah, M3 HHY mobile team. I'm on the ex I'm on the um, external antenna in the car now, um, which uh, isn't actually that much longer. Than, uh, than I thought it was going to be. Yeah, I'm just going to be um, just going to be going into the car now. Yeah, I'm just going to be going into the car now. Yeah, I'm just going to be going into the car now. Yeah, I'm just going to be going into the car now. Yeah, I'm just going to be going into the car now. Yeah, I'm just going to be going into the car now. Yeah, I'm just going to be going into the car now. Yeah, I'm just going to be going into the car now. Yeah, I'm just going to be going into the car now. Yeah, I'm just going to be going into the car now. Yeah, I'm just going to be going into the car now. Yeah, I'm just going to be going into the car now. Yeah, I'm just going to be going into the car now. Yeah, I'm just going to be going into the car now. Yeah, I'm just going to be going into the car now. Yeah, I'm just going to be going into the car now. Yeah, I'm just going to be going into the car now. Yeah, I'm just going to be going into the car now. Yeah, I'm just going to be going into the car now. Yeah, I'm just going to be going I think this video is just going to be a complete fuck up for the other video. <laughs> Thanks, I was filming part of my video there. Yeah, no problems. Well, we've got a couple of uh, couple of tests, haven't we, um, on both radios? They work. I think the conclusion is um, what we can conclude from it is the Kydera stock antenna is rubbish. Um, the diamond antennas make a massive difference. Uh, the Kydera does better in, um, does worse in an urban setting than the MD380 does. Um, yeah, so the uh, the MD380 and DMR comes up uh, comes up trumps in this one, as far as I'm concerned. For M3HHY Mobile. Yeah, I'm doing really excellent. Yeah, it does definitely. Um, yeah, I'm just going to be going into the car now. You know, that sort of thing, but I don't think that bad radio for the price, but you'd much rather be on DMR than DPMR using one of these. I suppose <coughs> we'll just have to get a set of Kirison. Well, you've got a Kirison on you, have to try a Kirison maybe. But, as I say, we bought these for encrypted conversations, didn't we? We bought these for uh, chatting by the external antennas at home. Uh, from my house to your house, you know, for a bit of privacy if we needed it. So I think for that, they definitely work. You know, I think that's the, that's the plus side of these sort of things. But the receive audio, transmit audio and everything else, no, it's not worth it. TYC hands down, I'm afraid. Yeah, absolutely. Um, when you think you pay 30 quid extra for the TYT, I uh, absolutely agree. I mean, I like the features on this radio, the fact that you can just um, enter your frequency uh, in VFO. Um, you can enter your, your shift and your offset for repeaters. You can um, switch between analog and digital easily without having to program it by a computer, which is, is great. Um, I should point out for the video... Um, they're not. It's, it wasn't encrypted. The, the, the thing we've we've discovered with these Kyderas is that the the, the codec that they use, um, my AOR DV1 digital scanner doesn't decode it, and the SDR Sharp software doesn't decode it, and they don't work with Kirison um, S780s, making the encoding um, as good as being encrypted because no one can listen to you really. Um, so uh, yeah. But uh, yeah, now they're they're a good radio. I uh, I, do, I do like them for the price, but I think you're right. The TYT MD380 uh, wins um, hands down, uh, definitely with uh, without a doubt there. From M3HHY Mobile. Yeah, I'm just going to be going into the car now. Need a subway, nice space, that but didn't get any coverage on it whatsoever. But the uh, there was uh, better 
jump out on the on the uh, conversation. But I somehow to get back to the car. I'll tell you what, it's bloody nippy. Really nippy. Should have put me, me uh, should have put me silly hat on and my gloves. <laughs> I've got some gloves somewhere. Yeah, I've got some gloves upstairs in my bedroom. We should have worn them. If I don't make gloves and hats on, it'd be dead comfy, but I'll tell you what, it's nippy out here. Very nifty. I'm on Zero LX Mobile. Yeah, I'm Zero LX Mobile, M3HHY Mobile Returning. Yeah, it is, it is really cold. I'd say there's a wind chill of probably about minus three, minus three, minus four. Um, even though the sun's out, it's uh, it's misleading, it's uh, it's freezing cold. Uh, right, Roden, I'm, gonna, uh, I'm just going to wrap up this video, so stand by and um, I'll catch you in a minute. Um, we'll go back on the MD380 if you like. Um, so 73, M3HHY, catch you in a minute. Yeah, I'll put the MD380. When I get in the car, I'll put the MD380 back on. That's it, Roger. Yep, catch you, mate. Okay, so, um, so yeah, I hope that wasn't too confusing. The way the videos worked out, the MD380 test was first. Um, he'll be saying something to why me up there now. <laughs> the MD380 test was first. Um, and the uh, the Kydera DP 550s test was uh, was second. Um, I've pretty much concluded everything uh, I wanted to wanted to say about this radio. Uh, it's good. I think um, out in the open it'd work absolutely fantastic. Um, in a more urban setting, a more built-up area, the MD380 does have the edge um, by far. Um, I think on analog it would be quite close. We haven't tested that. We tested digital today, um, but I think the uh, I think the quality of the digital standard on the DMR um, just enables them transmissions to get over um, the ground that slight bit better, uh, if that makes sense. So, yeah, the MD380 um, wins uh, wins for me. Um, but the uh, the DP550S is still a great radio for the price. These are like 60 quid. Um, MD380 is around 90 to 100 pounds, uh, depending. So. Yeah, um, I hope you enjoyed that test. Hope it, uh, hope it helped. Um, you know, if you're looking to buy one of these radios. Um, so yeah, thanks for watching as usual, guys. Seven three for now. We'll catch you again. Okay, so we've uh, we switched over to the TYT MD three eighty now. Uh, digital on seventy centimeter simplex. Uh, you'll have to excuse the handshake, it's absolutely freezing. Um, I've got Royden on the other end here now, so we'll uh, we'll see how we go. Okay, um, M0, LEX, Mike Zero, Lima Echo X-Ray, Mobile, M3, HHY Mobile, you receive me, Royden? Yeah, M3, HHY Mobile, uh, from M0, LEX, Mike Zero, Lima Echo X-Ray, Mobile, Mike Zero, Lima Echo X-Ray, um, mobile returning, yeah, it's uh, it's a massive improvement, isn't it? Um, I'm just filming around these uh, these locks now. Uh, yeah, absolutely uh, fantastic. Uh, no no um, packet loss, no uh, breakout whatsoever there. Um, yeah, uh, a million times better from M3 HHY. Are you receiving me? Oh dear. Yeah, a little bit of packet loss at the end there, but nothing, uh, nothing too major. Um, yeah, I haven't got these the stock antenna for my TYT. Uh, I've not got it with me because I brought this extended one with me because um, I didn't think we'd be testing both. Um, so I can't swap over there um, from M3 HHY. I just hope the uh, hope the uh, the wind noise isn't too bad on this video. Yeah, it's pretty windy, not ideal conditions. Right, do you want to... Uh...